Hey everybody, Wilfram Studio Zombie 3D here with a quick unboxing and setup of the Anycubic Mono X 4K printer. Here's a quick look at the specifications. I'll take a closer look at all of this once I do my final review coming up very soon. Let's get right into it. Alright, first thing we're going to do is remove all the protective packaging from the printer. They pack these things pretty tight in the boxes, which is good to see. First, let's we're going to remove the UV cover. Then in the center here, it has all your paperwork and all the parts for the printer. There's a quick look at the build plate, the vat, and all the parts. Alright, now we just got to lift it out of the bottom piece of styrofoam and we're ready to continue. Alright, I've got everything laid out on the table here. First we have our resin vat with the metal frame. Underneath that we have our setup instructions and a piece of paper you can use for leveling your print bed. And then we have a nice metal scraper for pulling the prints off the print bed itself. We have a few funnels here and filters for putting your resin back into the bottles after you're done printing and a mask. Next we have a pack of full of your tools and other accessories. First, your standard Allen keys. Here's your knobs for securing your vat down to your printer. The Wi-Fi antenna itself. The USB thumb drive. A plastic spatula. And a few pairs of gloves. And here's some extra screws for your resin vat if you need them. Next we have the power supply. It's just a standard brick power supply with a barrel jack that goes into the printer. Next thing we're going to do is get it powered on and install the build plate and level it. Now once we remove the plastic protective coating, we can install the build plate onto the printer. Once we have this locked down, we can proceed with leveling the printer pad itself. First thing we're going to want to do is put this piece of paper on top of the LCD screen. Our next step is to make sure the bed is loose and can move freely once we level it. There, now the bed can move freely. Next up what we're going to do is we're going to go into tools. Move Z and then hit the home button. Now, once the bed hits the bottom and finally hits its final position, we're going to apply slight pressure to the print bed and tighten up the four screws on the bed. Just like so. Make sure all four are very tight and nothing's loose. Now, to finish the leveling process, we're going to hit Z equals zero, hit enter, and then hit enter again. That will raise the platform. And that's it. Next thing we got to do is install the vat and we're done. Once you have the bed moved up out of the way, you can install the vat next. Make sure the FAP is nice and clean as well as the LCD screen.
The vat itself has four rubber feet on the bottom of it. Those sit in four spots on the frame of the printer itself. Just like so. Next, put your two knobs in and make sure they're both secure. Once you have them both secure, the printer is ready to go. All you have to do is load some resin and a print file and see how it turns out. Alright, that's it. It's ready to go. Alright everybody, that was just a quick unboxing and setup of the Anycubic Mono X 4K printer. Be sure to check out the Studio Zombie 3D Instagram to see what's going on in the studio. And be sure to check out all our links. Thanks for watching everybody and take care and we'll see you in the next video.